Rach and I are about to try and go do some yoga. A yoga flow because we're toit. I thought I slept in today till 6.30 and then I saw that there was a daylight saving change. And I was like, oh, it's 5.30. <laughs> wow. Oof, it's cold. Oh, it's only six degrees. Other days it's been like zero, two degrees. Just finished yoga session with my coach. That was really nice. Just, I find yoga is just nice for like, to relax the mind as opposed to kind of being a workout or anything. Just to listen to some relaxing music and just slow my mind a bit. It's nice. Did that and then a bit of upper body strength um, gym. And now we just got to pack and then we're heading to the train station. Again, sunny, beautiful weather. Bit cold now still but it's probably gonna get hot again later in the day so yeah looking forward to a hopefully smooth travel day that would be nice no hiccups please so I'm on the train right now and we have just gone through Brussels soon we'll get to Paris and then we'll change trains again And our hotel. How many trains and where are we? Seven trains. Seven trains from Amsterdam coming to Arnhem, Arnhem to Orleans. We made it. Which court? It's two, right? These are some bright lights. I have one tectonic nine that I want to play with, but I don't know if I should train with it in case I break the string before I play. <laughs> I'm down to four rackets. But I did manifested a broken string. I don't know, wasn't it just like a drop shot? <laughs> So as you can see, we're in the main hall here at Orleans Masters. It is Monday, so we arrived at Sunday night and all of us play on Wednesday. So today is main court testing. Um, we've been allocated half an hour, but we've actually been on for an hour and a half so far, which is really good. Usually you have like one court for half an hour and maybe a lot of players. Um, so we've been quite lucky. That's the perks of getting here early. Um, and then the next day, um, tomorrow and maybe this afternoon, we'll be just hitting on the, the training courts and other teams should be here in the main hall. It's nice, uh, the court feels, the stadium feels not too big, so it's pretty comfortable. We haven't had the tournament shuttles yet. They are, I think they're using Forza shuttles, but they haven't given us any. So we'll have to see the speed of that. Um, but there doesn't seem to be any drift really. Just, the courts are a little bit uh, slippery. They, they look brand new, so I don't know. The texture's a little bit soft and slippery. Hopefully no casualties. But Indo training here behind us. Canadians at the end. Miss Iris Wong and Kai from Germany. They're part of the, the Lonely Hearts 
club we have a little Facebook chat group for the like people that trade that travel by themselves. Jeff, you match the seats so well. Your shirt is on brand with the seats. I'm very proud of myself. I haven't spoken Indonesian for years and I was able to arrange some matches and training. They probably could have just spoken English to me, but I felt the need to practice my Indonesian. So you're Indonesian, do you want to play matches? My mind, my mind, game. Sama, for my Australia. Australia? Australia. Bulung Tankus. How do you say it? Bulu tangkis. Bulu tangkis. Oh! <laughs> yes! Go! Yes, Wendy. Come on, Kevin. The cord is big. Wow! How cool are these? Shuttle pops made from wood. It is day two in Orleans, kind of. Yeah. And it's 8.35 8.35 from Luna, Luna <laughs> says 8.35 How are you finding your first international tournament, senior First um, senior international tournament prep so far? It's very daunting Is it? <laughs> yeah Really? Being around like so yeah. many good players or yes. Is yeah. it different from juniors or like Yes, it's very different from what? juniors and tournaments in Victoria yeah, in Victoria, <laughs> in, Victoria. <laughs> in our little Victoria, Victoria state. <laughs> She's been stuck in Victoria for like two years, two or three years. Um, yes, it's, it's giving me flashbacks. When was your last international tournament? <laughs> uh, World Juniors in... 2019? Yeah, something like that. Where was that? Was that the Canada, Canada. one? Oh, Canada. Russia. 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 Yes. yes. So it's giving me very much... <laughs> well, junior vibes, but with well, older people, <laughs> better people. Yes. <laughs> so we had, we got two hours on the main court on the first day, which was good in our training. No other countries showed up and we were in the morning before a lot of like the other European countries arrived for their training. And then today we got about an hour and a half on the practice court, which was also good because we were only allocated half a court. And... Our coach kindly bought us some Forza shuttles because they're not giving us free test shuttles. So, thanks coach. Thanks Badminton Australia. <laughs> thanks Badminton Australia. <laughs> we just did some analysis on our opponents from Hong Kong for our match tomorrow. They play a very, from what boring. we watched, it was very, it was a little bit boring style, very long defence and... Can I put this in the vlog? <laughs> no, then they might watch it. <laughs> People want to know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, but so yeah, we have a we have a, have a game plan. Keep it a secret for now. Maybe that'll come out in the next vlog. <laughs> Sign up. See you, Grandma's vlog. <laughs> <laughs> We're at the notorious. Notorious. M I G. Came <laughs> on fixing her bed. <laughs> Super skinny beds with like. Three, two mattresses that all move independently and if they're not aligned they make the small bed even smaller. I'm just finalizing the next YouTube video. My million tabs open. Caitlin's watching Grey's Anatomy. Good night. Today we all play our matches. Day one of the main draw. And first up is Wendy. Women's singles versus Beatrice Corolas from Spain. And from what we've been told, the shuttles are very fast, easy to lift out. We're gonna have a light hit this morning on the training courts and then we have our match at 3 p.m. playing this girl who's playing the mixed doubles now. We play her in women's doubles.
the snow. See that? That's snow. It's fluffy. So I didn't really vlog anything around our match. We had our match two days ago. We lost in three sets to Hong Kong. I think overall the match was pretty good. I think our level was decent for our first international tournament off Caitlin's first international tournament in seniors. Um, I think the Hong Kong pair weren't as good as maybe what we expected and we definitely had a chance to win. We were leading like 16-14 in the first and then lost it and then we won the second and then the third just, yeah, let it get away from us. But yeah, I think it was frustrating because we could have won it. Like, yeah, not very happy with the result. Definitely a missed opportunity, but uh, yeah, a learning experience. Nonetheless, um, so currently on the train, early morning train at 7 a.m. here going to Paris. Um, we're flying out of there in, in a day or two, so we're just gonna sightsee around a little bit until our flight. Um, it's actually like one degrees now, so it's gotten quite a bit colder than the, uh, the sunny Netherlands from last week. I've seen photos of the Sports Institute um, and now it's like got like layers of snow there, whereas last week we were like sun baking and it. it's crazy. Um, yeah, so today we are gonna go around Paris a little bit. Um, our coach has to buy some designer stuff for his girlfriend, so we get to go into those shops and feel a little bit rich for a couple minutes. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I think overall the trip has been a good learning experience, good like start of our partnership. And oh, Wendy, our women's singles girl, is still in the tournament as well. The coach has to fly home, um, but. Yeah, good luck to her in her quarterfinal today. Team Netherlands, got the mascot, got the drink bottle, converted. <laughs> <laughs> 